Hey, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Eddie Harvey here from tradewithed.com, Forex trading account. How many should you have? So let's let's talk about it here for uh, just a couple of quick minutes, guys. And obviously, when you start out trading, you do you open up your account. Let's say you open up a live account. Uh, you throw a few hundred bucks in that account, guys. And that's where everyone typically starts at, especially if you're brand new, really don't know anything. You know, you got your live account open and you're ready to catch some profits, uh, catch some pips and make some profits, all right? Now, here's, here's where things can get a little different. So uh, let's say if you're trading multiple strategies or let's say if you are using multiple products, okay? Let's say if you're part of a platform or company uh, like myself where you have multiple products. We actually have 12 different products to choose from. And let's just say I was trading like four of those products. Should I put it all in that one account? In my opinion, no, uh, because, excuse me, what you want to be able to do, one of the things you want to be able to do with Forex, guys, I've learned is track your results. So get obviously have a trading journal writing down your trades. And let's say, you know, obviously if you're trading your own independent strategy, right? You, In my opinion, you should have an account for that. If you're taking signals or, or trade setups from, a product or service, you want to have an account for that. Okay. If you're hopping onto some, um, if you're, if you're trading, if you're hopping onto a live session guys and, and you're trading, uh, currencies from that, you, you can have an account for that. If you're trading crypto, have an account for that. If you're trading indices, have an account for that. And you might say, well, man, that's a lot of different accounts. Well, that's what's going to allow you to be able to track results. And then guess what? Everything is not mumble jumble. You don't know what's winning, what's losing. And then Let's just say on one of the accounts, guys, if you do, let's say you take a bad trade or you break one of the rules of trade, you don't lose a stop loss or you over leverage and then boom, things tank or something like that. You still have multiple other accounts to work from, okay? Versus having everything coupled and caked into one account. And you might be looking at, well, if I have, you know, all of my funds, if I have, let's say a thousand dollars in one account, I can, I can wager larger lot sizes, right? That's absolutely true. But patience, guys, is a, trading is a patience man game. You get the same time, you can take that thousand dollars, break it up into multiple accounts, guys, and you can take, let's say, five accounts of 200 bucks each. And now you got one for your main Forex trading strategy. You got one for crypto, guys. You have one for uh, copy and paste uh, trades that you're taking and so forth and so forth. And you can and you can run it that way and now take your main account and let's just say have that account be an account you don't touch and you're compounding that account and grow it out. And you look up six months from now, a year from now, and have some crazy, crazy profits in that account. Uh, but, you know, that's just obviously it's optional. You can choose to do what you want to do. You can put everything in one account. But when it comes to being able to track, that just makes it hard because, you know, if you're trading, you know, your USD in one account, then you're trading your USD in another account or uh, or a Euro GBP, whatever, it, things can get cross mixed up. And then there's like, damn, what, what trade was for what? So I, I, when I started, that's how I was. I'm like, oh my gosh, I got too many things going on. And that's when I went ahead and started trading different accounts, uh, having multiple accounts. Okay. So, you know, it, it gives you some options. And then, like I said, even if you have multiple accounts and you, let's say you were just trading your own strategy and you took your strategy and you, uh, opened up five accounts and, put 200 bucks each in that account. Let's say you took a trade guys on your strategy. Now you, you can have it to where you're still compounding to growing your uh, account across multiple accounts and having that to where now you have multiple streams coming in through breaking your money up that way. Okay. Just it, it's so many different ways you can do it. Right. But at the end of the day, it boils down to tracking, seeing what you have, and then also not putting it all in one pot to where if something did get wrong, boom, now you blew your account and all of your funds are gone. So, or, you know, it's all about how comfortable you are with your trading strategy and what you're doing and, and the way you trade. So all those things play in a factor to decide, should I have one account or should I have multiple? At the end of the day, like I said, the choice is yours, guys. So I hope you all, I hope you all got some value from this. Hope this made sense. Listen, if you want to learn more about the platform that I utilize to learn how to trade and the, and the products and services that, that I utilize to, to help me earn in the markets, Guys, simply go to tradewithed.com for more information on that platform. You'll be found out more about who they are, what they do, what, have, what they have their hands on, and how it can potentially be of benefit to you. Okay, guys, so in addition to that, if you thought this video contained some value, do me a huge favor and hit the like button. If you want to hear more from me, go ahead and subscribe to my channel. And guys, if you want to be notified anytime I do go 
uh, hop on here and uh, go live with some fresh new content or upload new content, should I say, simply hit the notification button and you will be notified of that. So guys, thank you so much for your time and thank you for taking out a little bit of your time uh, to watch this video and I hope it did help you in some form, fashion, or format. TreyLed.com, check it out guys. Thank you for your time. Talk to you later.